Okay, so today we're going to be reviewing the RTX Quattro A4000 by NVIDIA. What the card looks like, you can see, is dead. What I like about it is they're dead thin. They're basically designed for um, like sitting in you know, workstation PCs or servers, so they're dead thin. They're very, very power efficient. This thing is basically the same uh, architecture as a 3070, RTX 3070, so it's going to be interesting to see how this thing performs. So let's get straight into it. So over here on the rig you can see that there are two RTX 4000, A4000 cards. Um, and you can see that here and you can see roughly what you can expect from these cards is around about 60 mega hash for I would say around about 120 watts so they're very kind of efficient like hash rate to per watt is very very efficient you can see here on NB minor which I'm using you can see the efficiency and you can definitely get that efficiency you know up over 500 um, K for sure um, I've got two different I've got different settings I was just playing around with the the settings for the cards to see what I could kind of pump it up to in terms of uh, mega to watt uh, ratings and just just in my situation uh, I was playing around with it and I think I think for myself you can see it's got memory temperature here it's got the core temperature the memory temperature here I'm running at eighty percent fan you can see my uh, core clock on both cards you can see my memory clock on both cards and you can see over here on MSI afterburner just bring that in here you can see some of the settings so um, I've got 1600 plus 1600 on the memory clock um, I had this up at 1700 and it definitely runs fairly well but obviously you're depending on your temperatures. I, I, I put on 1600 just because of um, I felt the memory temperature was going to be a bit high. So do I recommend using this card? Well what I'd say is yes I do recommend this card for mining. As you can see the hash rate 60 mega hash at around about 120 watts which is very similar to a RTX 3070. Um, the thing I love about the card is how small it is. It's actually, in comparison to a 3070, it's actually really quite small in terms of width and also length as well. The length of it is actually a fairly, fairly decent size. Um, so, like, you know, if you want to put these in server cases, anything like that, it's absolutely great for that. So, thanks so much for watching the video. If you want to see more of this content, please subscribe below. There's going to be more coming on the channel very, very soon. All sorts of crypto and mining uh, content. So, please subscribe if you like the content, like if you like the video and uh, share to anyone you feel it's appropriate to share to. Thanks so much. Have a fantastic day. God bless.